Hey everyone, it's Shirt of Chroma Glitch, and today I'm going to show you how to defeat Thea, also known as the AI in the Vanguard, and get the Admiral's Corset, as well as the drum and bass for Fallon and Edge of Eternity. The Admiral's Corset has 14 power and adds 13 to attack, 11 to defense, 16 to incantation speed, and 13 to speed. While the drum and bass has 46 power and adds 51 to attack and speed, and 607 to health. The recipe for the Hell Cleaver is also in one of the chests in the room, but I haven't crafted it yet. To get the armor piece, you'll need to complete all three battle objectives. The first is to destroy all the turrets before destroying Thea. The second is to avoid damage from the self-destructing turrets. The final objective is to disable mole bots less than 10 times. Starting with the last objective, because it's very easy to mess this part up accidentally, make sure you don't attack the mole bots with any attacks that count as two attacks. For example, most of Darien's elemental strikes will hit the mole bot twice turning it back on. If you unlocked Fallon's triple shot, this will also turn the bot off and on and off again, counting towards that 10. Only use the base attack or a single shot to hit mole bots. Avoiding self-destructing turrets is relatively easy if you pay attention to the grids on the floor. If the grids near the turret turn red, move any character standing on the red tiles off of those tiles before the turrets self-destruct. Turrets will attempt to self-destruct once their health drops between the first two resistance icons on the health bar. You can also destroy the turrets before they have a chance to self-destruct. Since Thea is only really a support type enemy, you can work your way through each set of turrets quickly. After the turrets are down, you can easily take down Thea and complete the encounter. Once the encounter is over, you'll gain the Admiral's Corset for Selene or Fallon. You're also free to loot the chest in the room, which will give you the drum and bass gun for Fallon and the recipe for the Hell Cleaver for Eusaurus. I'll include the Hell Cleaver crafting in a separate video with the other sites and its tree, and that's our video. If you found the video helpful, be sure to leave a like, and if you want to see more Edge of Eternity content, be sure to subscribe.